Hello everyone, I'm so sorry I've not posted in a couple of weeks but I'm finally back making another squishy tutorial and I'm going to be showing you how to make a minion squishy and this actually took me a couple of days to film since this was quite a um, like challenging like sort of squishy to make but I still hope it will be um, easy enough to understand I did try to explain it as best as I could so yeah and this was also um, requested by Shania Swan so thank you so much for the request and let's just get on with the tutorial So first I drew out the template onto the foam and you can just find this template just by typing up minion template onto Google and you can make it as big or as small as you want and now you just want to cut this out. So here is what it looks like so far. and. Next what you want to do is you want to cut the arms a little lower than the body as you can see I've already done it with this one. So you just want to trim it just a little bit lower than the body. And you also want to do the same thing for the feet as well, just going just below here. So I'm just going to finish that and then I'll show you what to do next. So here's what it looks like after I finish cutting it all out. And I actually had to glue the arms to the sides because they were quite delicate. But here's just what it looks like. and. As you can see, I smoothed out the body as well. So now what you want to do is you want to draw on the um, overalls and the goggles and also the gloves as well. So I'm just going to do that. So after you've done that, this is what it should look like. So as you can see, I traced the goggle, the overalls and I also drew out where the gloves are going to be. And I also drew it out on the back as well. Sorry about my hands, they're covered in pen. And I just use a small roll of tape just to draw out the eye, but um, you don't have to draw just one eye, you can draw two if you want. So now we can finally move on to the painting. Okay, so I went ahead and I painted the minion yellow and I also mixed a little bit of um, blue and black together and I painted the um, overalls and I painted the gloves and the shoes black. So now the last thing you have to do is to paint on the eye. So I'm just going to do that. Sorry this wasn't actually the last step, there's still a couple more steps to go but here it is after I've finished painting on the eye. So I just filled it in with white and I painted the eye brown and I also added a little bit of black and white in the center and then I just went around it with silver puppy paint and I painted the strap parts black and I also used black for the smile. So now the last two things that you have to do is you have to paint a little G in the centre using your black puppy paint 
and you also want to paint on the hair and also a few more details on the overalls so I'm just going to do that and then I will show you the okay so I painted on the G in the center so if you can't see that's because my shadows in the way but yeah it didn't come out so well it doesn't really look like a G but I tried and by the way, you can just use an image um, for help if you are struggling with that part. And I also painted on the hair as well, as you can see. So it's basically just six lines. So that's what it looks like. And now the last thing to do is to let this dry. So here it is once it is all dry. And I know it's not really the best as you can see I did get a few paint smudges on the back and also in a few other places as well but oh well I still think it looks pretty good and it can also stand as well So yep, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thank you so much for watching, bye bye!